Hello, 大家好，我是 Chelsea， 欢迎收看卧室理学中文。In today's video, we're going to talk about some of the sequential transition words in Chinese, which are the words that put sentences in order. For example, such as first of all, and then or next, and so on. We are going to learn these transition words by applying them into a real example, which is the different stages of putting an elephant into a fridge. 首先，我们要找一只大象和一个冰箱。First of all, we need to find an elephant and a fridge. 然后，我们要打开冰箱的门。And then we need to open the door of the fridge. 接下来，我们把大象放进冰箱。Next, we put the elephant into the fridge, and the elephant says, "Long, cold, long." Oh. 最后，我们关上冰箱。Lastly, we close the fridge, and then we say bye bye, 大象 bye bye, elephant, 大象 bye bye. From the instruction of an elephant into a fridge, we learn the four sequential transition words. Number one is. 首先，首先，首先 means first of all. 首先 ，after 首先 is 然后，然后 means and then afterwards. 然后 ，after 然后 it comes 接下来，接下来 means next following. 接下来 ，and lastly we have 最后 which also means lastly. So let's read the whole paragraph again. 首先，我们要找一只大象和一个冰箱，然后我们要打开冰箱的门。接下来，我们把大象放进冰箱。最后，我们关上冰箱。Notice that 然后 and 接下来 is interchangeable. You won't. And make much difference of the meaning of a paragraph. You can say 接下来 and then 然后 or 然后 and then 接下来 they're both okay. Notice that these are just few of the sequential transition words, and then there are a lot more in Chinese. So if you want to find out more or learn more Chinese, then just keep following Chelsea and subscribe to my channel. And、uh, yeah, that's all for today's video. Um. Blog post will also be available on my website if you wanna take a look of the transcript. So yeah, that's all for today. I will see you guys soon. 再见，拜拜。